Did you know the gaming industry is worth more than the music and filming industries combined? Today, I am here to inform you about the origins of video games. First, we're going to talk about who invented video games. Next, we'll speak about what was the first video game. And finally, we'll talk about video game consumption. Today, I'm here to inform you about the origins of video games. Let's start. Who invented video games? Well, according to the Smithsonian website, Video Game History, the first archetype of video games can be traced back to the 1940s. Thomas T. Goldsmith Jr. and Esther R. Mann patented a device called the cathode ray tube amusement device. Others like William Higginbottom created an electronic game called Tennis for Two. But the first true video game was not invented until 1967 by Ralph H. Bear. I personally became interested in video games around the age of seven. I loved playing hand games and card games with my siblings, and that eventually turned into us having a full-on gaming childhood experience. Next, what was the first video game? According to the history website article, Dawn of the Home Council Developers at Sanders Associates, Inc., led by Ralph Bearer, he invented a prototype multiplayer, multi-program game system that can be played on a television. This became known as the Brown Box. Bear eventually licensed the device to Magnafox, who sold the system as the Odyssey. And the Odyssey became the very first home video game. My very first home video game was called the GameCube. Some things I enjoyed playing on the GameCube is SS Tricky. I enjoyed playing Sly Cooper. I, play, I enjoyed playing Crazy Taxi. It was just a whole plethora of games that me and my siblings indulged in and that created the best childhood experience ever for us. I'm actually looking to purchase one of the GameCube today just for the memories and the games. We can move on to our last portion, which is video game consumption and consumerism. The sales of video game consoles and cartilages plunged in 1983 and 1984. There was just not enough demand for it. Today, the video gaming industry has a yearly revenue of over $17 billion. Today, I do contribute to that because I do own a PS5 and I continue to have a day where I set aside and I play the game all day. The idea of video games has honestly came a long way from the start. To, in 1983, go from gaming consoles and cartilages having almost zero sales to 2024, they have a yearly revenue of $17 billion is truly astonishing. To conclude, gaming is one of the greatest financial impacts of the world. First, I spoke to you about who invented video games. Next, I spoke to you about the very first video game invented. And finally, I spoke to you about video game consumerism. Thank you for taking the time to listen to my speech about video game origins and have a great day.